Honorable Speaker, uh, Mr. Fred, Mr. Fred, you better listen or ki and keep quiet or listen to me in silence. Or you can walk away when you don't want to listen to me. Uh, because I want to give pregnant points. Yes. <laughs> Mr. Speaker, what steps should we take? Mr. Speaker, inchi ya Kenya, in a face anger. Kenya sahi ni drought stricken kuna drought stricken zones na chenye nitu anga drought ni natural calamity when you talk of a natural calamity ni kitu hata we mwenye ukipatiwa awezi ukazuia hata kama raila ndake kuwa rais leo ange zuia drought tusidanganyane ati sasa tusijui ni nini drought iki, is a natural hata wewe Unaona? So a drought mambo na drought Water member. Mambo na drought ni kama tsunami inaweza hit mahinchi fulani. Na nafiki drought kwa Kiswahili inaitwa kiangazi. I think if my Kiswahili could find it right. Sasa mambo ya kusema sijui nini ati serikali nini Tuko na natural calamities of different kinds. And once they strike, we mwenyewe uwezi kazizuia. Ni mungu tu mwenyewe aneza kakuja intervene. Ama mchukue steps ingine za kusaidia. They are, the steps are only mitigative. You can only provide a mitigative step or a mitigative procedure. Like sai, nweza tumia kukontribute. Sisi kama wanabunge hapa, tuseme tuko na paybili yetu ya kusaidia wenzetu wale wakuna kiangazi. Ama tunaweza push sirikali itowe, itowe usaidizi kutoka mahali naweza Ama sirikali can source for food from foreign, from, from foreign land Kwa zile inji ziko na surplus kwa chakula So hii mambo ya kublem sirikali when the, when the drought strikes Si kitu ya inafa Sisi we Kenya kama tukona njia vile tunaweza tengeneza ujanja ama uwezo Ya kusaidia wa Kenya wenzetu ambao wanaumia mali We ya fadhali sayu unaona, unaona maji kwa nyumba yako Kuna mwengine ajaona tayo maji for the last one week Or to even for a month Maka ngombe ikakufa Sasa hii when you are talking here Siju ishu ya nani ya candidate fulani Ni kama unacheka pia wenzaku inuwana the other So Mr. Speaker The northern part of the nation in a first sheet that is true But to you as a Kenyan what are you doing apart from this contribution to help your friend or your relative who is suffering in the northern part of the nation? Don't blame William Ruto. Don't blame the MPs. Don't blame any other person. Leadership starts from you as a Kenyan. Assistant, philanthropic character starts from you as a Kenyan. What can you do? One of the things that I can do is to send a message to the government if I don't have money. By pressurizing them as bunge la wanainchi. Kupi, bunge la wana hinji kazi yake si kupinga sirikali. Bunge la wana hinji kazi yake ni kukosowa sirikali na kusukuma sirikali. Itende wema wana hinji. That is what bunge la wana hinji is meant for. Until when will you be criticizing government? Hata saka kama government kifanya kitu mzuri, will you just be criticizing the government? We need to push the government and we kosowe mali mefanya makosa. Na kai mefanya mzuri, we also credit it. Mali mefanya kazi mzuri. Sikila siku tu nini 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 hapa hiki ya rere. Hili ya ifai. So honorable members. Hii mambo ya kiangazi. Mimi ni naomba. Na nilishukuru honorable rigadi gashago. Hapa nae ni na mkredit. Kwa kufungua pay bill. Hile unazaka kitu kidogo. Wa Kenya wetu ambao wako northern. Wasaidiane. The best thing you can do is little money you have. Send in that pay bill. Ulona. Gashago alifungu account. If you are really a Kenyan, uwa na ule ambaye anonea mkenya wake, anafako na mesha mzuri. Towa shilingimia moja, uweke kwa hiyo pay bill. That is the way. You can help you, Kenyan for Kenyan. Unaona? Kama una, unanyamaza, una, unatulia. Eh? Sasa, mimi na homa hivi ndugu yangu. Pay bill iko. Kama uko na amsini, hata shilingi kumi. 
Niongeze na kumi yangu hiyo ni mbao. Na hao wengine itasaidia mahali. So let us just be sober enough if you, if you really if you are really human. If you are really human enough. Let us contribute through the pay bill tusaidie wa Kenya wetu ambao wako the northern part ama mahali popote kuna kiangazi. Kelele mingi haita tusaidia. Mr. Speaker, mambo mambo ya IBC. Mr. Speaker, I want to say this. Honorable nani honorable members, why don't you be rude? Be patient my friend. Mr. Speaker, mambo ya IBC. Mambo ya I IBC is an independent body. You can read about IBC kwa sheria. Maybe if you can appreciate your time, usome chapter 7 of the Kenya Constitution utapata IBC hapo. And by extension tena ukuje chapter 15 utapata IBC as an uh, independent officers and commissions. Mr. Speaker, IBC ni institution iko na mikakati yake imeandikwa kisheria. Usitengeneze sheria yako sahihi hapa kwa bunge. A commissioner has to has the right to serve for 6 years. And that is what is prescribed in the constitution. Chebukati atafanya kazi baada ya miaka sita. And I believe miaka sita yake iko karibu kuisha sijui next year. Mwezo ikiisha anaenda nyumbani. There is no option. Bado siamaliza utaliza utauliza. There is no option. Sheria inasema vizuri commissioner anafaa kufanya kazi miaka si miaka sita. Akimaliza miaka sita Chebukati will go home bila shida yote unless kama kuna issue ange, aneza tolewa so mambo ya kuuliza sijui IBC sijui nini hiyo wacha sheria ifanye nini ishughulike kila commissioner hata wewe ukiandikwa kazi leo hata wewe ukiandikwa kazi leo hata wale ambao watachaguliwa kwa hii bunge leo wako na time yao na timeline yao ya kufanya kazi sasa kila mtu lazima elewe kuwa sheria ndio iko Mr. Fred, be silent. You are a senior. You are a senior member in this house, but you are heckling. Are you a goon? I will pick the question. Nikisha Malizia. Na Malizia. Mr. Speaker, the freedom of speech. I mambe ya freedom of speech. Yenyu muna tuambianga kila mara, and you are giving useless speeches. We will have to control and tame your speeches. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, Mambo ya kusema freedom of speech, give a constructive speech. Unasikia? You must give a constructive speech. Wait, say me, Meisha. Unasikia zwali. Unasikia zwali. Mr. Speaker, the incoming speaker, anatumisimidi. Ebu usikia, umesema, kashaku wamefanya vizuri sana, ametua namba enye tutakuwa tunatuma pesa kwa hile namba. How are we going to believe in this guy yana... Aijaisha hata mwaka moja alipotikana na graft kesi akanyang'anya 222 million. How are you going to trust this guy na hiyo pay bill number yenye ametoa? Sawa, ujibu hiyo. Mr. Speaker. Angalia ndugu yangu tulieni. Tulia, wacha kelele. Mr. Speaker, nataka nisaidie nataka nisaidie ndugu yangu. Gashagwa ali launch to pay bill. Pesa aiendi kwa mkono ya Gashagwa. Pay bill sigi ya shagwa. Wewe ukilonji barabara, barabara ni yako. Barabara pesa inaenda kwa pay bill. Ile, si, si kwa mfuko ya gashagwa. Inaenda kwa pay bill ambayo inakuwa monitored na wa, wale ambatu, wale watu ambao wamewajiriwa na serikali. Si gashagwa. Umesikia? Sasa usi blame gashagwa, mahali ya faiku kuwa blame. Wacha tu blame sayote sayote bila sababu. And what is free with this? Free with this. Okay, asandi, asandi, asandi. Asandi sana. Asandi sana. Eh, eh, wabunge, order, 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 order.